Horses have been called. They're on the track and pretty to the post. This evening's first race, first half of the Daily Double. Claiming handicap Pacers racing a mile. Purse of $2,600. The one is Profits Ace, sold by Jan McPherson of Xenia. Jan McPherson trained Jack Daily Drives. Number two, San Rook, sold by Tim Minch and Howard Murray of Ohio. Tim Minch trains for Jeff Fount. Number three, Telephoto, held by Barry Conrad of Canal Winchester and Mike Metters of Columbus. Mike Metters trains, Brad Hanners drives. The four, Fonda Samadi, held by David Franklin of Lexington. Tommy Smith trains for Mike Wilder. Number five, Alante Spur, held by Hugh and Beverly Richards. Dave Klotz trains, Mark Klotz drives. Number six, Novelistic, held by Troy Thomas of Cable Ann Hiltebrand trains for Don Feaster. The seven whiffed, owned by Charles Geiler, Letha Brooks, and Cheryl Amble of Ohio. Hugh Beatty Jr., the trainer driver. The eight knockout Vaughn, owned by Steve Morningstar, Monroe, and Elliot Deaton of Somerville. Elliot Deaton trains and drives. And number nine, Beeler Hanover, owned by Edwin Cook of Londonderry. Richard Cook trains and drives. Win play show perfecta and a trifecta wagering along with the first half of the daily double. Second race, second half of the double is clear. No changes. First race claiming Pacers lining up, moving in. On the back stretch, there they go. Handed, they're off, and from the inside, it's Fonda Samadi. First for the lead, whipped from the outside, is sent hard. From off the pylons comes Prophet's ace. Drop again, fourth at the rail, Sand Rook. Then it's a gap, three lengths, five, Telephoto. Another two lengths, sixth to Alante Spur. Followed seventh by Novelistical. Eighth at the rail, knockout, Vaughn. The trailer ninth is a Beeler Hanover. Around the first turn, whipped. Sets the yearly pace here, leads the way a length. On the outside now, challenging second comes Fonda Samadi. The opening quarter, 27-3. And Fonda Samadi is out and moving quickly here. Whiffed on the inside. Racing is second. Profit Ace remains at the real third. San Rook is fourth. Still three lengths to Telephoto, who's fifth, but is now moving. And two lengths sixth to Lante Spur. Feel a bit strung out here as they race into the clubhouse turn. And on the front, it's the four. Fonda Samadi at four to one by two. Whiffed on the inside is now second with Profit Ace still gapping third. Half and a quick 56 and four. Lively pace here for the night's first race as they swing to the back stretch. And San Rook is the first to come to the outside. He's pulled the pocket. He's fourth. And grabbing that cover, but still gapping slightly as Telephoto as Alante Spur moving quickly up the rail is now sixth. To the outside, Novelistical is seventh. Beeler Hanover from off the back end is racing eighth. Field begins to tighten up a bit now here as Fonda Samadi continues to lead by two with Whiff right there racing second. Three quarters, 126 and four. At the rail and racing a third. It's Prophet Ace and San Rook is showing no pace of the outside. He's a sluggish fourth. At the rail is Alante Spur as they swing to the top of the stretch. Now less than an eighth of a mile to go. And down the stretch they come and on the front. It's Fonda Samadi, but whiffed on the outside. Here comes Prophet Ace. A 30 to one shot is closing with every stride. And Prophet Ace pulling off the first up set of the night in 157-1. First race is now official. Track sound in the winner's circle. Winner of the first, number one, Profit's Ace. Five-year-old son of good to see you from the crash mare, Great Profit. Owned and trained by Jan McPherson of Xenia, Jack Daly in the Sonky. First one of the season and only his second start of the 96 campaign. That is a career mark for him, 157 and 15th. Profit's Ace. Returning $69.80 all on a $2 win ticket.